Mike, we're so proud that your name's on the stadium and we've got the statue of you up there. I want to thank you on behalf of all the fans, all the student athletes, University of Texas and athletics. Thanks, sir. It was so flattering, I, I, it was beyond my comprehension. When you grow up in a little small town of 5,000 people and they tell you that they're going to put a statue in your honor, it just out of sight. Mike Myers has both with his vision and leadership and with his philanthropy made sure things were done uh, at the very highest level. So he's a great personal friend of so many of us and having his statue uh, here where we can enjoy it is something I'm uh, just very grateful for and excited about. He's a personal friend. He's been a friend of the university. Uh, I know, uh, you know, that a lot of people do a lot of things for Texas Myers. It's just one of those that's very special. Mike has a heart that is as big as Texas. He has cared so much for this university in so many ways. Uh, we obviously know him well as an athletics uh, benefactor. But what a lot of people don't realize is how much Mike has done across campus. He believes in higher education and opportunity for young people. And today will be a great day to celebrate his legacy in that regard. 30 years from now when a four, four by four relay team come in from Giddings and the kids come around and see this statue and know that there was a man that cared enough to build them a facility to run on and to show their skills and, and uh, have a good feeling about it. I think Mike will stand on this spot today, look out over that beautiful scene with the Capitol and the University in the background, and I'm sure thoughts will cross his mind uh, what education can do for someone um, if you work hard and you care enough, and I, I think there's no better setting than the Texas Relays to say thank you, Mike Myers. It changed my life, and that's the main thing, and it's changed a lot of other people's lives, and I just happened to be one of thousands and thousands that it, it took someone from a small rural town in Texas and broadened my horizons and made me think in a different way. And that's what's important to me as a person, and all I've tried to do is just give some back because I feel very obligated to this institution for what it's done for me personally.